am here with Mike and Rodney from Survivor. We are here at the Baseball Tavern. First question for you guys. It seems like you guys didn't really like each other, and now you're hanging out in Boston. What's up with that? Listen, sometimes you got to go through trial and tribulation. Sometimes you got to get knocked down and get back up. But sometimes you just need somebody there who's just as real as you. And when the game's over and the punches are thrown and the balloons are hit, you realize that guess what? Texas and Boston get along, baby. And that's why we at Fenway Park having the best time of our lives. I mean, the, the biggest thing, the craziest thing that I can say about Rodney is day one. Day one, we were in a battle. And we did it all the way for 38 days. You, when you're on the battlefield, you compete. But when you walk off the battlefield, you shake hands, you respect the man that you played against. And I respect this guy. I mean, he played a hell of a game. You, you have dirty water TV. We have the Dirty 30. And what the Dirty 30 means to us is that we're a family. And that's, that's truth. I know you did an impersonation of Mike winning a million dollars. I was on stage and I got that million dollars. I thought Jeff was going to vote me out right then and there. And we were going to go back to battle. You better relax, bro. You better relax, bro. <laughs> Dude, if you don't get involved with it right now, I'm going to get everybody on this blue car drive to vote your ass out. Now. That being said, y'all can do my person all you want because I'm sitting there with a million dollar check. Hey, so, be here in Boston with my boy Hot Rod, Fenway Park, living out my dream. I want to thank y'all. I love y'all coming from Texas. A sixth generation Texan, I might add. Yes. Um, what about your Boston accent? Oh, well, I'll tell you like this. I, I, I would not ever try to steal Ronnie's impressions because he does them better than anybody else in the world. But I will say this. You better relax, bro. You better relax, bro. You better relax, bro. Better relax, kid. If you don't relax, bro, you want to get more firewood, bro? We're going to get intense. We're going to get intense. Firewood? You want to get some firewood? I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Sorry. We, this yeah. is, this a, is this a true, kind of crazy. A true bromance. A true bromance.